fire fall, please. This is where the magic happens inside Roxy's Grilled Cheese Food Truck. With ingredients such as avocado, bacon, and rosemary, this, as Roxy's would say, is not your grandma's grilled cheese. Roxy's is quickly gaining popularity in Boston and here at Boston University. I personally love being here. A lot of uh, friendly faces. Everyone's always in a great mood here. I really, really like the people here. Um, I think the school has a lot to offer. I came here last week with my friend and I got the green Munster sandwich, but I heard the um, french fries are so good, so I came back this week to try them. Mike and brother James started the business in early 2011. The idea came from their time touring as a band. We lived off of uh, just $5 a day to eat. It seemed like we ended up making grilled cheese almost every day when we were on the road, so uh, we took that concept and, and uh, we brought it to the streets. After two months on the job, they got a call from Food Network. We learned a lot from, uh, from the great food truck race that we did season two. It was a tremendous learning experience. You know, We got to learn the fundamentals of this truck, working together as a team and uh, doing everything as fast as possible, basically. A year later, Roxy's has grown in popularity. They have 20 people running two trucks seven days a week, and the feedback has been well received. It's really good. On a cold day, it's comfort food. I'm loving it. It's awesome. Roxy's has a lot of tricks up its sleeve. They use mayonnaise on their bread and truffle oil on their fries, but there's one secret they won't tell us. Who is Roxy? For JO351, I'm Nick Cope.